we've brought together different organizations and different trade unions that had never worked together before. This means that this is a historic moment. Today we had 80,000 uh, students in the streets. This is completely a new thing for us. And it happened because all of them, in the end, are Democrats. And all that they want is to vote and decide the future of their own country. We are not here because of independence. There are some people that are uh, pro-independence and some others against that a concept, but it's about democracy. We just want to vote. We just come together and every people's like um, collaborating with each other. And we are always a group, um, I would say a family in fact. Like, I don't know people, but you're maybe here and people offer you food because you've been here the whole day. You go together and you're defending the same right. It's human rights just to decide what we want to do, what we want to be in our future. The Spanish government has always been saying that um, in the 78 when the constitution happened we started a democratic transition but in the end we never actually got the democracy. We're seeing it nowadays for instance. Um, the Catalan people is asking for a referendum and the Spanish government is not allowing people to speak. We saw how the Spanish police entered some public buildings. They detained some of the people who were working for the referendum to happen. They identified people in the street um, to, because they were collaborating with the referendum. They are closing websites. They are forbidding some Catalan magazines just because they talk about not just independence but also the referendum we want to do. There is a list of 300 organizations that are from the Catalan government and also that collaborate with the Catalan government whose um, money has been controlled by, by the ministry in Spain. They try to control our police, the Catalan police, but so far it's not happening. And also we're seeing a lot of Spanish police in the street. So we will mobilize all the students if we see any repression from the Spanish state in order to avoid the referendum to happen. When we see a vulneration of our rights, our way to react is by doing more campaign. Campaigning has become illegal at the moment, but we want the campaign because we want the referendum to happen, and we understand that this is a normal election. So, for instance, what we're doing here is printing different material so that people can collaborate with the referendum in the streets. We're also printing some paper ballots that can be official also for the referendum, but there will be paper ballots in these schools when people go to vote. It's a way to show that even if they try to stop us, we've got the capacity enough in Catalonia to make the referendum happen in a normal way. We all understand that the independence for us is a window of opportunities. So to this, we can have a better state and especially a democratic state.